Here's another one of the questions from philipjensen.com that you have sent in. It says, living in a society that struggles with alcoholism and gambling, is it appropriate for Christians to engage in either? Specifically, things such as poker tournaments, where there is no money used and social drinking but not getting drunk. Uh, they're frequently advocated in my Christian peer circles. I'm incredibly uncomfortable with both. I'm going to write on the subject of gambling in my From the Dean article, so look out for that and you might be able to see something on the whole subject of gambling. But basically, the problem is not risk-taking, but covetousness. Materialism, desiring possessions. Playing gambling games, e.g. For, for matches, is well, it's something I certainly did as a child, and in one sense it's quite harmless. But it does normalise the activity, and frankly for me, it did lead me into a very bad scene in my teenage years. So, when we came to having our own children, we didn't do it in our household, and the way we raised our children didn't include that kind of activity. On the alcohol front, I think our society is just in terrible denial. The problem is as large as smoking, but we haven't come to terms with it yet. There are massive health, crime, violence problems, to say nothing of the number of driving and swimming accidents that are caused by alcohol. And alcohol abuse also leads to the breakup of families and to the economic ruin of people. Now, there's nothing wrong with alcohol. It was created by God for our benefit. In the same way that there's nothing wrong with heroin or morphine either. But the way we use it can be disastrous. And I think the evidence in Australia for misuse of alcohol is overwhelming. So here are four quick points. One, I never drink alcohol, I never have, and I don't intend to either. Two, the alcoholic is the victim, not the criminal, or even the sinner. He or she, they need our help, not our condemnation. Three, I'm opposed to the social organisation that normalises our society's attitude to alcohol. And four, I'm involved with Overcomers Outreach to help addicted Christians find fellowship and addicted non-Christians to find Christ. It meets first Wednesday of the month after the healing ministry here in the cathedral.